Ashley here at Happy Harris. Um, so, bad vloggers at the moment. We are currently nearly two weeks and I've just went wonky. Sorry about that. Oh, 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 oh. I don't know what's up with my tripod today. It's just not working. Okay, so we are currently at maybe just come up for two weeks without posting anything. So apologies for that. Um, it's been a bit crazy here at the moment. Um, work has just gone full pelt um, so I'm coming in and I'm just so tired weekends oh my goodness like I'm really struggling with this tripod Rob's not here he does all the tip tripod stuff um, normally so yeah I'm feeling I'm gonna go wonky again but apologies if I do um, yeah so work has gone absolutely crazy um, plus we've decided to move house um, so this is what, when is this this is like mid-April, so we're thinking about moving uh, end of May. So, yeah, we're finalising details and stuff. So, it's been a lot of house viewings and flat viewings and, yeah, you know what it's like. And starting to pack as well, because even though we don't have anywhere yet, we would like to be organised when it does come to this, so it's not like a mad rush. Um, some of our, f where this would be flatter house number five that we've lived together we've been together 12 years so yeah it's been a few moves um, and they've usually been quite a quick turnaround of quite a rush job so we'd quite like to be organized this time um, so yeah apologies for the lack of vlogs recently it is going to get more interesting um, I'm off to Ireland next week with work so I'm staying in some nice hotels and I'm visiting some nice tourist attractions so yeah I'm gonna take I probably won't take might take some videos uh, I'm not gonna take the posh camera I'll just be taking some photos and stuff on my phone and I'll put them into a blog um, in case you're interested in visiting that area I've personally never been to Ireland so I'm really looking forward to it although I do have to get on a tiny plane Ooh, so nervous but I it'll be fine and it's worth it because it's getting paid for by work so I can't say no and um, a couple of girls wanted to go my name got pulled at the hat so I'm feeling very lucky about it and um, so even though we haven't been doing much vlogging at the moment I thought I'd do well just as a quick update um, but also one of my friends that I used to work in Disney with and um, she set up a business and um, doing the body shop now you know the body shop does has their shops on the high street you can actually have them um, like in your own home like the parties and stuff like you know with like the Avon, the Ann Summers and stuff um, unfortunately she lives um, down south um, so I can't basically book a party with her but I can support her and um, yeah so I've ordered a couple of products from her I don't know what they are it's a mystery box or a mystery bag very excited this is not an ad she hasn't paid me um, I paid for the products um, and then my camera's gonna fall sorry yeah well that's not a good angle Um I paid for the products um, I'm gonna put my phone there to stop it moving um, I paid for the products um, she didn't charge me delivery because I was gonna say something on camera about it um, so yeah um, her name is Carly um, she is based south of London, Gravesend I think it is. Um, I will put a link to her um, her shop down below. Um, you know, I'm in Scotland, she posted it to me. Um, I think her rates are really reasonable for post and packaging. So, do you know what? I like the body shop stuff. So, it's a mystery bag. All I had to do was let her know, apologies for the noisy budgie. He's been by himself all day and I'm by must I've just come in so he's like tweeting away um, so all she wanted to know was what kind of skin I had and she was going to put like a face package together so I haven't opened it um, I opened the white package it came in at work just a brown envelope nothing exciting and its package is like this see body shop I have opened the back only just just to save me faffing about on the screen see so it's definitely body shop um, and inside the envelope I get two little samples one for Shia hair it's not gonna focus is it hair mask it smells amazing and then also cactus blossom body yogurt and again these are tiny like it's the size yeah you can get the gist of how small it is and then also just a little card with her details on it 
So yeah, I'm gonna open it and see what's in it. So I have seaweed oil balancing toner. Mm, it's very blue. Oh, that smells really nice. So yeah. We got a really big bottle as well. Got the seaweed deep cleansing gel wash. Now this has all been put together for my um, for my skin type. Um, so so I'm combination skin type. I also got ooh, rose dewy glow face mist. Hydrates, illuminates, makeup friendly. This looks so nice. I'm gonna actually gonna sniff this. I'm actually gonna spray it. Oh, that smells so nice. Like, you know how sometimes rose water can smell a bit like grannies? This one's actually really nice. Again, a nice, like, big bottle. And there's one more thing in here. Oh, it's a headband. Now, you know, to, like, so you can do your makeup and stuff. I actually need one of these, a new one. Um, so I'm glad I didn't buy one, actually. Um, yeah, so that is all that's in the bag. And do you know what? For £10, I think that's a pretty good deal. I'm not going to lie. I know the, the seaweed toner and cleanser retail about £8 each. So yeah, she'd said it was about £20 about the product was worth. So yeah, I'm quite impressed. I know the headbands are about £3. So yeah, I would definitely recommend that. Um, so what else has been going on in our life? Um, Rob is working crazy just now. Um, he's coming up to his busy time as well. So, oh, I can't wait for a few weekends just to chill together. Off to Blackpool, two weeks, two weeks tonight. Go down on a Thursday night. We're there until Monday, so we don't actually have that much planned on the Friday or the Sunday, the Saturday we're doing roller coaster club stuff with the roller coaster club of Great Britain. Uh, we're doing the Pledge Beach. But apart from that, I have a feeling the Friday we might actually just go drinking. I know we're not big drinkers, but it's kind of a tradition when we go to Blackpool, we have one day that we just sit in the pub. There's a couple of pubs that we always frequent, the Laughing Donkey on South Pier. We've got a new ice bar on Central Pier. So we'll try maybe I don't know, someone said it was really expensive for what it was and it was a bit gimmicky. So I don't know, maybe maybe we won't try that. But I mean, we can show you where it is and stuff. Um, what else are we getting? Like I said, I'm off to Cork, Ireland next week. And then, yeah, we're kind of in the run up to summer, hopefully. Summer will be nice and we'll get out and visit some places. Um, yeah, and then I'm gonna do a separate vlog for my planning, but um, yeah, Disney's coming along. I'm gonna do a reveal of our, not EDRs because we haven't booked them, but like the ideas of the dining that we want to. Again, guys, if you can recommend the restaurants that you guys like, because where there's a couple where a bit like, hmm, maybe, maybe not. Again, I'll go into more detail in my Disney vlog because I want to kind of keep them separate because they're gonna like, Especially after the summer, it's going to like ramp up when I'm trying to book my fast passes, get information about Animal Kingdom Lodge. Um, so yeah, it's, yeah, it should be good. Um, so excited about it, but it's, you know, it's hard because like the summer in my new job is going to be absolutely crazy. As you can see, I probably look tired. I am tired. Um, I'm on call this week at work, so basically if there's any clients that need assistance 24-7, they get me. So I'm not really sleeping that well this week, but I felt it was unfair to go without doing a vlog again, because we never did one last week, so. But we don't have stuff to vlog, it's hard. Um, especially since we're, you know, not new at vlogging, but we do vlog about our life and stuff, and when there's nothing happening, it's hard. There's also a bit of a channel change coming soon. Um, a bit of a change of name, a um, bit of rebranding. Um, it's in the pipeline, so we will keep you up to date with that. Um, thank you all so much for subscribing, liking, commenting. Um, we did hit our 
200 subscribers la last week start this week yeah start this week so we're so overwhelmed you know we never we never started it for you know subscribers we just enjoy doing it and if you enjoy watching that's that's a bonus we quite like doing the vlogs so it's nice to know that there's other people that do like us as well so you know what share like us comment because i love reading the comments that's kind of my job um so if like i reply if we reply it's usually me that does it because rob doesn't get involved in that side of things but do feel free to ask us questions we're very open about things obviously things like our job and stuff we can't really talk about that much but um yeah just thanks again everyone and we'll hopefully not be two weeks before we do another vlog but who knows see you soon bye